Welcome everybody to the seasonal diet, eating what our ancestors ate, when they ate it, like we were evolved to do. Got some cool info that many of you might not know, um, but you all did it uh, if we go far back enough in your ancestry. At this time of year, in the late winter, a very interesting ingredient found its way into our recipes and foods all around this time of year, and that ingredient is charcoal. Humans would put this into their food for healing, or what we today might call detoxing or cleansing, and we have records of this all the way as early as 3,500 years ago. In ancient Greece, there are records of how charcoal would be ingested and used for this purpose, and this was kind of, at a certain point of time, it was dismissed as a heathen art, but in the past 200 years, modern science has actually shown some of the benefits of charcoal, including, you know, kidney and intestine health, it's an antifungal, anti antiviral and antibacterial. It's good for the skin as you will find in some of these topical lotions have charcoal in it and many other good benefits to it. In the north of Europe we would traditionally bake it in bread or even cakes and especially these next few months now we find a tradition of this that could go back thousands and thousands of years. We don't really have sources of how far back it goes exactly but uh, why they did this, it makes 100% uh, sense. Uh, they would do this to detox or heal or cleanse after the winter and prepare for the spring and the summer, the coming season of the work. In the winter time, it's very possible that humans probably ate some food that had been spoiled, that didn't last the time, and you know, food was very scarce and they would have eaten what they could. If it went rotten, they probably would have eaten it anyway, and uh, lots more illness going around in the winter too, by the way, and of course the winter it'd be lots of meat in the diet, and, and dairy, and pickled, and preserved, and salted, and sweetened foods that humans would have eaten. No fresh stuff, which is of course not the best for your stomach or health long term, so they may have realized that after this winter diet they needed a cleanse, and charcoal in the diet was a way to do this. So later on I may show you how to bake this in a bread, uh, like a traditional recipe, but that it honestly takes a lot of work and time and you have to find the right place to uh, find the charcoal. Me, I just take charcoal supplements. Remember, not all year round, just from about February to May um, at the times that humans would have uh, had that in their diet and, and charcoal tablets uh, supplements are available in pretty much any grocery store or supplement shop at least. 